usually, you know, in yachting, when they hire deckhands, they're in their 20s. And, you know, when you're 35 years old, you're applying as a position on a yacht as a deckhand. People look at you like, okay, what's wrong with you? <laughs> you know, why are you so old and you just want to be a deckhand? Well, because that's all I was qualified for at the time. My name's Captain Lee Rossback, and I'm a captain on private motor yachts. Started when I was 35. I started out as a journeyman boiler maker, served my apprenticeship, worked high steel for a few years, but uh, really couldn't see myself making that walk into the steel mills for 30 years and then getting a gold watch and a cheap steak. So I went into the restaurant business. I got introduced to yachting when I uh, purchased a restaurant down in the Turks and Caicos Islands. And an 85-foot yacht pulled into Turtle Cove Marina where we had our restaurant. And I was just like, wow, that is gorgeous. And if somebody gets paid to run that? I hadn't seen the ocean until I was 35, so I didn't even know that world existed. Took a job on a sailboat and doing a delivery because I needed the money. I was sick the whole time. I mean, really sick. Seasick. But it just... You know, there's something about being out there that's just, I just love it. And after that, the rest, I guess, is history. Let it out. First time I worked on a yacht was back in the late 80s. I was in so far over my head, it was just incredible. True passion is when it's something you would do for free and somebody's actually paying you to do it. Great musicians sometimes will tell you that. They'll say, you know, I'm getting paid to do what I would do for free anyhow. I don't know if the goal initially was to be a captain. The, uh, my goal has always been to whatever it is I'm doing, I want to be the best at. And that meant, you know, going as far as I could go in my career as, you know, on the water, which is captain. So it can take sometimes up to 10 years. You might liken it to a struggling actor. You may get one part here, one part there. But in the meantime, you still have to eat, so you're waiting tables, which I did. You know, I worked in restaurants all the time. I was building my career at sea. i take the work when I could get it, upgrade my license when I could, but it took years to get to where I'm at now. If I have some advice, it'd be never give up. It's out there, and when you find it, you'll know it. If I could go back and, and do it over again, I would, I would have, you know, probably gotten into yachting at an earlier age than, than waiting, but obviously I didn't know about yachting. When you find your passion, you find something that you, you really, really love, and you would do it for nothing if you didn't get paid for it, that's it. And you know it. There's no doubt in your mind about it. Hey, NBC News viewers, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.